Community Matters Now. Major changes are coming to Southwest Fresno. The City Council unanimously approved the relocation of the Darling Rendering Plant. Residents have been fighting for this relocation for decades. They say the plant creates a strong odor that could lead to potential health hazards. KC24's Bailey Miller live in the newsroom tonight. So, Bailey, it's going to be a long journey to move this thing. Yeah, residents say this issue has been going on for nearly 60 years after filing for their lawsuits and fighting for their health. This decision tonight is being described as monumental. One Southwest Fresno resident after another. It's all about what's doing what's right. I, too, agree with the fact that that plant's got to get out of West Fresno. Voicing their concerns at Thursday's Fresno City Council meeting about the Darling Ingredients Meat Rendering Plant that exudes a strong odor, something residents in the area say creates health hazards. On the way to and from church, it's just, you couldn't have your windows open. It gets in your cars, it gets in your nostrils. It's just awful. And nobody should have to live with that. Mary Curry, a part of the group Concerned Citizens of West Fresno, has worked for 13 years to relocate the plant. It would mean there's a possibility of new development, possibilities of new businesses, clean energy things coming in, and clean air. And on Thursday, council members listened and agreed that residents deserve a clean place to live. They unanimously approved the relocation of the Darling plant. 7-0. Councilman Oliver Baines has worked alongside community members for years and says this relocation is monumental. Tonight what we saw was a resolution that was a win-win and it's a very, it's a, it's a special historic night for the residents of West Fresno. At the meeting, council members also unanimously approved the Southwest Fresno specific plan. It will lay groundwork for investment in Fresno. Now the Darling Company is seeking new ta new market tax credits that will provide money for this relocation. And Councilman Bain says that we will have a timeline on when this relocation will be by the end of the year. Live in the newsroom, Bailey Miller, KC24, local news that matters.